there, this is JPJ Blazers! And I'm back with another Blazy Log. What the heck? Okay, something was blinking for a second there. Not sure whether it's because I changed my render distance to four chunks or what. It was originally at five, but anyway. This is Blazy Log number 34, recorded on April 29th, 2014. Yes, that means next Friday. Will be um, the time I start school, and it'll be interesting. Uh, on the bright side, I do have all the courses that I actually want, including two that. Well, I I do want them, but they are part of a. Um, oh, maybe I I thought I did have two cobblestone stairs. I guess not. But anyway that I actually want, and actually even my SHSM courses, which it's specialist high skills major, which basically just gives me free training and paperwork with my diploma that basically tells any corporates I want to work for that I'm better than everyone else at my subject. <laughs> Oh, I love the way I put it, but first things first, this is for you, I'm the surviving gamer. I am not sure whether I'm gonna make- well, you know what, I have enough for a pickaxe and a sword, and since my pickaxe is the, lo the lower one, I am going to build my pickaxe first, so. I know I forgot to do that in the previous Blazy Log, but I remembered this time, so kudos to you. Ah, oh, shh! Ah! What the freak? Are you nuts? Are you freaking nuts? What the freak are you doing outside my door? I swear, according to Game 3, those things are made of these explosive moss plants. Uh, the worst part is, it's like, a, so, so it's almost like a Venus flytrap in the way that it's a violent plant? Good lord! But, how about this? Oh, some coal, how about that? How about that, eh? But, uh, and speaking of hesitations, like the one I just made there by saying, um, that is something you won't be hearing from me in these review videos i will while well, that will be released sometime or another on indie gamers as well as review articles i've done i'm not going to tell what they're what game they're about but they are about an indie game but as far as that goes i cannot spare any details it is an actual paid profession so we, we do have a code of secrecy at Indie Gamers UK, and I might not be from the United Kingdom, and I may not speak British full time. I hope that did not sound anything offensive. <laughs> oh, shoot. The more I laugh, the more I mine at things I don't need to mine at. Darn it. But... Yeah, I'll have some cool stuff coming up there soon, and it, it, it's it's awesome. I I personally have a love for sharing my opinion on games, and plus, hey, there's Blaze on Nation. I share my views on political crap, skis on crimes and stuff. So go check out my podcast. Of which way, um, Thing and I will be doing. The, not 11th, 17th episode of the Blaze on Asian podcast tomorrow. I got a, f oh, I'm on stairs. And yeah, we all have some interesting topics. Mostly, spoiler alert, these are going to be more around the gaming stuff. Mostly since a couple still, were, still, still, well, we... Still. That, that's the other awesome thing about tomorrow night's episode, is we have, for the first time, enough listener contributions, well, if any, because we only have, 
Why am I mining with my iron pick? I'll put that back in my inventory, but we, for the first time, will be running that new segment, listener contributions and stuff. And in other things, because I don't want to run out of time on talking about my other stuff, K Corbeard and I, we will be on, on our Blaze Corps channel, which is our collaboration channel. Break, we break. will be releasing our first actually Blaze Corpse series for I believe Left 4 Dead 2. And I say I believe because um, it, it's it's a learning process, or at least for me, because I'm not really used to commentating on games like Left 4 Dead 2, which I, I feel like it's a bit more story driven, in my opinion. And again, that is just my opinion, but yeah. So agree with me or not, that's what I think of games like Left 4 Dead 2. Um, Crystal Crow's GoFundMe campaign is still doing well. She's at about 13,000 uh, or so dollars. And I I'm really thinking I will probably also use some money towards it. I was gonna do Truve, but you know what? Well, what's better? A game or helping someone get the life, get their life back? In my opinion, I'd rather help her get her life back. And plus, she's, she's just an awesome person. She really is. And ra rather keep on then keep on stone, that subject because I don't know stone, I I'm trying stone. to come up with something witty and not Jump. sound offensive as I may already have <laughs> and sorry if I have um, not a thing I like to do but it happens it's we're we are all humans we make mistakes but um what else i've lost five dollar bills for some reason since earlier this summer um which was actually the it started with a five dollars reimbursement on a yearbook that i ordered from my school which I had ordered it with personalization next thing we all know. I think it was about half of them or so that did not get that personalization. And I forget if I've already mentioned this on a previous Blazy Log, but I lost that money. And then the summer, I lost another $5 prize money from the OMLA from our monthly shoot. And monthly, no, annual shoot. And uh, maybe get some outside time, cause that's spreading. I wonder if I have a crop grown yet. Nope. And I apologize for the leg. It, for some reason, just the outdoors here seems to be most leggy, and I think that whole crapper there is probably. It's either cause I'm on a snapshot, um, one eight pre three, or it's because. Of uh, the render distance, should I? Yeah, I might as well end it off around here or so. Get some outdoor work done here. And um, so I've been losing money and learning that I need to keep a wallet on me more often. Doesn't mean you need to pickpocket me if you ever, ever somehow find me. But just, just to let you know, it's not that hard to lose money and yeah oh and i finished watching breaking bad season two this week which if you're a worrier the series is not for you and it's enough for me because i'm a worrier and it really gets my guts well written series as always and i highly recommend it just not to those who are high blood pressure warriors because if you're anything like me or worse you'll suffer through watching that series but we also had the shaft last night the vic spaceman podcast tonight which was actually pre-recorded and again my podcast tomorrow but i'm out of time now but 
I thank all who watched. This has been JBJ Blaze with the last Blazy Log till school. Bye bye!